I think it would have to be Daytona. You know what I mean? It's just, it's outside, it's, it's good, it's nice weather. I feel like, uh, I feel like it would just be appropriate there to, to race Daytona naked. And it's a hot race, it's tiring, so maybe less clothes on would make me be able to last a little longer. I really wish Lawrence was back. I miss that kid. He's like a brother. Yeah, so I'd say him. It was a little different being on the hills. Um, yeah, it was it was definitely a little different uh, kind of crazy situation. Not not it definitely was no supercross.com interview. But uh it it was it was good and yeah, we destroyed Pat, Pratt. We destroyed Pratt. <laughs> oh, that's it. <laughs> I don't really have any relationships off the tracks with, with a lot of the riders. I, I usually just kind of uh, I do my deal on the track, and when I'm off the track, I'm hanging with the people that, uh, that love me most. So I wouldn't say that'd be uh, the motocross people. <laughs> wouldn't be people I race against. Australia was rad. It was, it was a good time, for sure. Uh, it definitely... Um, it opened up my eyes. <laughs> Not even a little tiny bit. It's a done deal for me. After Supercross, uh, I want to go travel around and go to a bunch of different countries and go visit and hang out and ride and do cool stuff, but there'll be no outdoor riding for me. There's no Lambo here. I don't know, I couldn't answer something like that. I got a 97 Toyota that just keeps running. I just keep adding oil. Thank you guys for uh, sending me all the questions, had fun answering them. I hope I get to see you guys at the races soon.